Hi, and welcome back to Doomy Gaming and Gray's Prophecy. I am at this greenhouse that I was at the other day. What I, I thought maybe that this might have been uh, Bruce's mansion, but I was told by one of my subscribers that there is a way into this house underneath the tree that was standing here. Well, I took the tree down, and I'm digging now because Tabby told me that there's some great loot down here. She also warned me that it was very dangerous. And I have to be very careful because there's a bunch of zombies down here. So, I don't see an entryway so far. But if this is the house that I think it is, isn't the entryway underneath the front porch? I don't know. But so far, oh, there we go. Look at that. Tabby, you are so smart. Thank you so much. I mean, it's been over a year since I played Seven Days to Die, so I don't remember half of the entryways into some of the great houses. So this was very helpful Helpful that, you know, she uh, shared it with me, and I am so glad. Well, it looks like <laughs> there's a trap down there. I don't want the dead parrots. I just don't have room for it. And I would imagine that I'm going to go down here and create some noise. Oops. Which is not going to be good either. Okay, this isn't the house that I thought it was. I was expecting a room filled with stuff. Maybe this isn't the house I thought. But it's a different one. Oh, I already see a zombie there. Not good. Thank you so much for the tip, Tabby, <laughs> because had it not been for you, I would not have, like, put anything in this doorway, for real. So this helped me immensely. Thank you so much. Ooh, is that radiation? Oh my gosh, really? Didn't expect that either. And you should not be able to clip through this block, buddy. That is just so wrong. But, saves me the time of having to crack through it myself. I can't believe that I've got radiated zombies already, really. I hope there's no more in here. Do not have a gun. Give me my crossbows. Um, I mean my crossbow arrows. So, this is against my better judgment, but. Shit, and it's a locked door too.
That one's locked as well. Well, this is not good if I get stuck in here, you know, with more zombies. Oh, level two pistol. Nice. Oh, a battery, which we need. I was actually out wrenching cars when I came across the house. What is that? Sinks. Okay. That works for me. And uh, let's see if we can get into this. I don't know if I have enough locks on me. So please work. Wow, one lock pick. Oh, nice. Very nice. Well worth it. And I've seen another one of these greenhouses in here, so. Well, I wouldn't mind the dead flesh for my garden. There's no more zombies in here, though. I think they come running out of these places, didn't they? Oh, shoot. There is one. There's another guy over there, too. Oh, my gosh. Well, that fixed that, didn't it? You could keep my arrow, aren't you? So only a few ran out of this room then. Not all of them came out of this room. I want to venture all the way in here. Someone else heard me. All right, so it's like a morgue or something. Oh, he sounds pretty close, doesn't he? Maybe he's in that room. All right, well, we got the good stuff. The stuff that matters, right? So again, we have to thank Tabby for that. She's awesome. Oh, I guess we'll be back to wrenching cars until we find another one of these wonderful houses. But thanks to her, now I have a level 2 pistol for Horde Knight, which is really nice. And I do believe this is a place that has another section upstairs, is it not? Like, on the very top. And that's why the, the vulture came down to swoop at me. I wonder if there's definitely more people in the house. Oh! Definitely more people in the house. Wasn't there a garage around here somewhere? I think it was over on this side. I'm kind of hoping there'll be a car or two in there that I can wrench. But a vulture did come down and get me, and I'm pretty sure that there's a box or two up there on top, right? I can't believe I'm getting oh, radiated. 
Zombies. Let's, uh... Where is that pistol? Let's put that here and here for now. Uh, I don't want this. I don't want these. I just I'll wake her up at least. Oh, it did more than wake her up. It killed her. Okay. Let's close this door if we can. Oh shit! Ah! Ah! <laughs> I totally forgot that there would be some up the top. There's gotta be a door here to close, right? I don't wanna get caught again. I think there's a box up top that they protect. That's why the ladder's there. That stuff, though, is garbage. I don't think I can reach that. Alright. That's just so wrong. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. the laundry room. A pair of shades. I don't think anything else is here. <laughs> Encumbered again, but Let's test my theory here and go up there. I just want to make sure. It's going to bug me if I don't try it and then I find out that there was stuff up there on the roof because that area looks really familiar to me up there. Might even be zombies up there, so I've got to be careful. Yeah, see, I was pretty sure there was more up here. Wasn't much, though, but... Hi, Missy. At least you're not radiated. Sit down there? Not really. Okay. Uh, I thought there was more better stuff up here, but guess not. I'll take your mechanical parts, though. All right. Let's skedaddle. <laughs> Yes, more rotten meat. The more the better. All right. All right, I'm going to go wrench some more cars because obviously I don't have enough batteries. There's two here, but then again, I'm not really running that many. I'm really not running that many uh, traps. For horde night. So 
maybe that will suffice. these throw that out and I need the extra weight right now that's steroids but it would be a waste to take one right now uh, what did I put my bike oh And the running slow part. Those cars rarely give batteries and engines, so we want cars that still have the doors on. So I'm just going to continue wrenching cars, and when I have enough batteries, then we'll come back. To be together. So until then, um, I'll see you in a bit.
Oh, nice. room that we were already in, right? Where'd you come from? Yeah, this is the room we were already in. Okay. And this is the room that we went upstairs. Okay. I know this house. This is the house that has all the cement and uh, exercise machines in it. But we really are overburdened here. So this is the blue house.
All right, this is like the house we just went through. Cool. Okay. But we won't do that now. I'm looking a little peckish here, so need to get some drink and, and some food. So I'm going to go back to the base. Something you like? I really admire you, friend. Thank you. I bet you wouldn't do this for just anyone in the wasteland, would you? Thanks for shopping here. Come again. Thanks anyways. Uh -huh. Be careful out there. That's about it. So thank you for spending time with me. I really appreciate the fact that you were here. Uh, we're probably going to make another video later, but right now I have to go make dinner. So until we meet again, Great doing business with you, you take care, go be safe, and have fun. Ciao.